So I'd wake up around 6.45, go for a lift, um, classes around 9.30, and I'd go until 12, get some lunch, practice around 1.30 uh, for a few hours, and go back and study. So it's a, it's a big commitment. NCAA has an intention of maintaining purity in, in competition, recognizing the term student athlete. They've made a, a valiant attempt to remind the, not only the general population, but also student athletes that you're a student first and an athlete second. Um, you can't have necessarily the allure of being paid and competing for that rather than competition because ultimately, um, in my opinion, you, you're, you're running the risk of distracting student athletes from the reason they're supposed to be there, which is receiving an education. I'm talking about college. So we're, we're taking four years of a kid's life. We're giving them, schools are giving them an education if they're willing to take it to prepare them for the next 40 years of their life. What's more important? I think if you're, if you're going to compete at the collegiate level strictly for um, money, you're probably doing it for the wrong reasons and you're probably not going to last very long. The point of NCAA athletics is to have the integrity of like going to an academic school and I think once you start paying athletes it kind of like takes away the purpose of collegiate athletics. I don't think, I can't see it ever really changing. The National Labor Relations Board actually found that the players could in fact unionize recognizing that they were, in fact, employees by definition. You've got to have the student athletes actually follow through and say, okay, we're going to unionize and then enter into a collective bargaining and negotiation with the particular universities. It really then puts the ball in the university's uh, court uh, to determine whether or not they, in fact, want to recognize that and negotiate in good faith or just simply decide we're not going to, we're not going to move forward with this. We'll drop football. We'll drop basketball. It's not that important. We don't want to have to bargain with these athletes. Um, and it's not all that remote of a possibility. 